Hi everyone, this is Gabriel from Blew My Mind. I've decided to give you guys a side-by-side -side comparison between Office 2013 and Office 2010. Uh, on the top screen you're going to see Office 2010. This is how the uh, application loads itself for the first time and on the bottom is 2013. So right away when you load it it asks you all types of questions on the 2013 side in terms of if there's any templates you want to load or go with your recently saved files on your left. So here is a template that we're going to download just to check how it looks like. So let's start fresh. When the menu screens are open it looks almost identical in terms of the layout that the icons are at the top but uh, let's go through every single tab to see if there's any differences the right screen so clicking on home you can see on both ends we got the uh, paste icon on 2013 looks a little less detail same with the cut and copy and format so you'll see a little graphic design difference the layout of the fonts and stuff seem to be a little bit clearer to read between the two. So basically what I'm seeing right now, everything is the same with the exception of change style on Office 2010 is on the top right. They don't seem to have that over here. Now let's click on insert. Again, all the icons are different. Everything, all the layouts are different. Here's one, apps for Office. So if there's an app you want to insert, you can do that. They allow you to add online video to your document. They added a comment box. Then we got the design button. So that's how they did it. They basically created this themes tab as a design tab in 2013. And then after that, we got the same icons all across. So this is all identical at this point. References, everything is the same. Mailing review so they added the show comments icon over here and then view word so basically everything seems to be the same something i wanted to point out in word as well as office 2013 that microsoft has decided to start showing information from left to right rather than up to down so you can easily click on your keyboard left and right buttons and you can see that information's navigating left to right so just to give you this added feature in order for you to get out of it, you click on view and you click on edit document and then you revert back to your typical layout. And uh, the reading view typically opens up the way I m mentioned it when you're opening up a Word document directly from an email. So that's about it for Word 2013 versus Word 2010. From what we saw, basically the icons are different, less defined or a little more brushed up, all depending on your opinion and uh, they allow you to insert some videos from the internet directly into your Word document. So for that specific uh, add-on, I don't think you need to be rushing for it. So that's it for this video. Just please give this video a thumbs up. Do subscribe if you'd like to see other videos as I release them. So thanks for watching.